All right, guys, how's it going? So this is going to be a very quick review or a demonstration of the free add-on called Match Render Visibility. I'll put the links in the description down below. Go and check it out. Now, this is actually written by Andreas, and it's his very first add-on, so we need to go a little bit easy. <laughs> and if you don't know who Andreas is, I've actually got an interview with him. I'll put it up in the top right. Check it out. It's pretty damn cool. Now, in terms of add-ons, it's not going to change the world, but it certainly does come in handy, especially if you're a bit like me and sort of forgetful. <laughs> now, what I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to enable restriction toggles. So, viewport, disable. And I'll guarantee you, at some point in your life, you'll select an object, you'll hide it from the viewport, and you'll hit render. And, of course, the goddamn cubes there. So, this is where this add-on actually comes into its own right. So let's say, for example, I want to match this viewport. If I click on hidden, it'll actually disable anything that's been toggled. And it'll hide it from the render engine. And that's one of the reasons why this add-on's pretty damn cool. So this actually works in reverse. So let's say I enable it in the render viewport, and it's not shown. If I click on render, it'll bring everything back. Now, it's a little bit destructive, and it could do with a little bit of work, but the fundamentals are there. So just as another working example, let's say I hide the icosphere and the cylinder. Now these are technically still going to render. I'm only hiding them from the viewport. So if I click on viewport, I'll actually bring them back. And that's pretty much the three options, render, viewport and hidden. And it really does come in handy, especially when your scene becomes much, much more complex. And that's pretty much the basics of the add-on. Do me a favour guys, like the video, subscribe to the channel, just hit the goddamn button. Follow me on Twitter, you know what to do. Take care.